hawking, paquing, knocking, whatever you call it, it's one Cajun Easter tradition that brings generations together. I'm Kaylin Lamano, your culture reporter here in Lafayette Parish with the history and tradition behind pocking eggs. If you haven't heard of or participated in egg pocking before, you may be wondering what exactly it is. Pocking eggs is a game, it's a competition in which you take two boiled Easter eggs and you um, knock them against each other. So each one of us would have, have an egg, uh, like so and we would, one of us would pock the other. So it's something like this. This is what we would, this is how the competition would look. And when I was a kid, that was, that was what Easter was all about. But an abundance of dyed eggs isn't the only connection between Easter and pocking. At its roots, egg pocking was a very religious display. Egg pocking refers to a tradition which goes way back, way beyond Acadiana's days. Um, it actually goes back to Greece. They were dyed red, which represented the blood of Christ. And when you cracked an egg, pocking eggs, that represented the rebirth of Christ. But through recent generations and into today, pocking eggs has become a playful tradition, a game that brings together families and communities. For Bernal Lemoyne, the annual Easter egg knocking contest is an opportunity to return to his hometown and see old friends. The fun of it is the competition. I mean, it's competing, but, but even more so, like not living there anymore, What's fun about it, too, is you see people that you haven't seen in a long time that come, that they know it's a gathering place. And as a result of that, you see people that you have not seen for a long time. Every Easter morning, there was a large, large group of people there to take part in the Easter egg knocking contest. Make sure to grab your strongest eggs for this Easter and get to pocking. In Lafayette Parish, I'm Kayla Lomano, KATC TV3.